Hey there guys, I'm Danks564 and this is continuation of our let's play of um, Outer Worlds and we're about to go to the to the caves. We have really low amount of uh, heavy ammo. We need to buy more of it, but I don't think I've found any any of the uh, What do you call it? Vendors. That's the word. Oh, let's go over there. It seems like we need to go there to find the, the guy we're looking for. Bertrand. Oh, there's a Manti Queen in there. He's probably dead. Yeah, that would be easy. Do your damage to the Manti Queen, please. I've had quite enough of you. Well, Bertrand, how about a little help there? Uh, Entomorph for um, having been sworn by insects now many times, you no longer your best when being attacked by them. Dexterity minus one, temperament minus one, perception minus one. Uh, sure, let's accept it. How about damage plus twenty? Resident? Resident of what? You there. Uh, Bertrand? Hey there. Is that because I'm still under effect of, uh... There we go. That assist was a violation of corporate law if I ever saw one. Since it was to my benefit, and we're largely in lawless lands, I'll look the other way. C3 owes you one, stranger. Awfully sensible for a businessman, aren't you? It's what I'm known for. Or what I'm usually known for, the occasional mishap notwithstanding. You haven't seen Constance, have you? Ah, there's her torso. And better be her legs over yonder, never mind. <laughs> I'm Bertold. What in the void are you thinking, creeping around a mana queen like that? At the time, I was thinking... Please don't see me. Oh, law. I don't want to die. Nah, nah, nah. Now I'm thinking it was stupid to come in here. <laughs> She's three sent me to find you. Means they're still holding the post then. Good. You might head on back. We can talk more there where it's safe. I'll be on my way. Once I've gathered up Constance's parts. Okay. Which one is Constance? I don't see her parts. Oh, maybe they're over there somewhere? I don't know. Oh, that might be her. No. Well, okay then, let's get out of here. No actual reason for us to stay here. I don't like a bunch of Monty Queens, other insects, so... Totally not worth it. Mission accomplished. It was actually quite easier than I expected. I was expecting like to go and crawl there through quite a lot of caves and uh, investigate it quite a bit more, but yeah, no, we're, 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 we're here. Also, I wish there would be a um, vendor here, but... Hey there! Hey, Mana Queen Slayer! Glad you made it in one piece! After all, not everyone's so lucky. 
meet my corporate compliance crew. Then check out our weapons locker inside. I reckon you'll find something you like. Then we call it even between us. Okay. Hmm. Kind of odd for, for a group of mercs to label themselves a, uh, as a corporate entity. A corporate model is the oldest and most efficient, not to mention stable structure history has ever shown us. Plus, corporations got certain rights, not entailed to individuals. I lead the C3s. Addy covers our payroll and expenditures. Lance handles the human capital. And Donald is our charming public face. Our system works. We've racked up more confirmed kills than any other crew you can hire. Okay. Good for you. So... Which locker did you open for me? Uh, sure. I'll take all of that. Mighty generous of you. Yeah, it includes all of that as well. Okay. Oh, and this, and that. Cool. I'll be taking all of it from you. Um, you really don't need that. Because uh, I'll be dealing with the Marauders for you. So, have fun. Now, let's, uh, let's go deal with Marauders, I'm thinking. Because we're here. Might as well. Or we can just yeah you know what let's let's just uh, deal with that. We're here, aren't we? Also, information broker will provide us info on science weapons, right? How many years do you think it took nature to shape the rock into a set of horns like that? To be honest, I'm surprised it's still standing. Every time I set foot inside, I half expect the tower to fall over. Nice hit. No. Just kill it with fire. Covering it. Sometimes violence is the only way. Nice Vicker. Nice da nice da nice nice da. Nice job. Continue moving. Oh, come on, just that already. Good. Any more of you here? And we're alive. Cool. Uh, sure, let's pick it. We'll sell it. Let's go pick up everything they had then. Mostly I'm looking for a weapon. Uh, for ammo. Who the hell are you? What the hell? I'm trying to like... Claim my, my victory here. Bastards. Okay, let's go... Oh, hold on there. Let's go back. Sneaky bastards. <laughs> like, literally, when I just finished them, they. Hey, we did that. Nice work. You should check in with my crew. Damn, Maybe but I like the you. way you fight, stranger. Go back and follow the trail Wish we could join you, but I got orders to stay. Okay, so will they be just sitting there? Before we go in, how about we check what's, uh, what's up here? Hiram must have sealed the door. He's. He's pretty sexy. Well, I would have sealed it too if I uh, were attacked by a bunch of marauders. So, don't blame him much. Okay, open up. 
Are there any more of them here? I wonder. Uh, it looks like it. You may not realize this being as you're an outsider, but the blaring alarms indicate the station's on lockdown. Which means you can't ever get it. Cool. Ain't gonna budge while this place is on lockdown. Vendor. How about we sell value to wait? Before we do anything, let's sell all the junk. Yeah, we'll sell that. I think we need one of those at least for uh, for lockpicking purposes. Can we buy ammo, please? Where is ammo? Would it be here? No. Will it be in weapons? Yeah, it will be in weapons. And that's not a lot, but I guess we'll take what we can. Toughened. Okay. Guess we keep moving forward. Look for another way up. This one's sealed. Are there in here or... There's something there. We can open it without trouble. Oh. Hmm. Really nothing in there. Barb, the new environment controls terminal is now installed and running upstairs. Congratulations, you messaged corporate about it. You get to manage it. Consider this is your this your official notice to hide it. It's access key card deep in the uh, in the bottom of a drawer somewhere, preferably with uh, the archives or in one of the station's other popular sections. Because I sure as hell will not allow our station efficiency score to plummet due to pointless safety f uh, feature. Don't even think about it testing the system out. The emergency sirens will make your ears bleed. And if you accidentally trigger the fire suppression system, it can suck the air from the room faster than the station's last uh, performance review. Okay, so he says we can actually use some sort of a... Elite Trooper Armor. What sort of Elite Trooper Armor is that? It says it's okay, I guess. Do any of you guys... Nyoka, what kind of armor do you have? It's better. Um, really, 508 DPS. I guess I upgraded it. And Vicar, what, what do you have? 3... 310? Oh, well, I guess... Keep that. You could use the socialization, you son of a bitch. Also, he hired me. To what purpose? I happen to have some significant problems I am dealing with right now. Marauders, running out of purpleberry wine three days ago, not being able to bloody broadcast. Uh, well... I see why Neoka tolerates you. Fine, I'll do the talking. By the hand of fate and my own cunning skill, I run this station. The Marauders may have other plans, and since my hired hands have clearly turned idle, it appears I have need of you. As my newest contractor, you may call me the Broker. Or we can call you Hiram. 
on account of that's your damn name, and doubly on the account of the broker being a dumbass alternative. What? Everyone calls me that. Aside from you. Okay, broker. See, Nioka? I barricaded the broadcast center, but I can only hold out for so long. Clear the marauders out, and I'll pay you double the going rate. They destroy the transmission equipment, and I'll be out of business. The elevator and doors to the second floor are back online. Hurry before I have to lock them down again. Hmm. Okay, I'll see what I can do. It's not like he has uh, much of a choice here. I'll, uh, I'll force him if he will decide to be a dick about it. Okay. Hey, elevators to your right. Get ready. To my right, over here. Okay. Where are they exactly? Over there, I see. Well, hello there. Probably executed. Find you. Heard something. We got trouble. Oh, come on. I got it under control there. Seriously, you're still alive? How are we still alive? Ooh, shit. Hits hard. Who are you shooting with? You're shooting with a pistol of some sort. Almost killed me, like in two shots. Okay. What else do we have here? That's probably the exit, yep. He says, well, there's like a huge sign of exit right above the, uh, the door. What kind of other shotguns I have? So this does 42. This does a lot more. Uh but it's not it, it's not a shotgun though. It's a uh, thunderer. Where is the Mark II? There we go. Yeah, let's go with that. I'll probably have to... Oh, what do I have here? Just mirror controls. Hmm. Before I do that, like, just to make sure I don't kill the broker. Oh, I guess I could have snuck through here and, uh, you know kill them like this but who cares that's the last of them I think okay probably there was some more of them I guess but now it should totally be fine was there anything here yeah Okay, ready to proceed, I guess. Oh, so that's where they were. Oh. 
Okay. What is that? Oh, it's a flamethrower. Uh, anything else you got here? What do I have here? Mm, sure, might as well take it. Pulse hammer. Oh, it's it's closed. Right, right, right. Do I need any of that? Not really. No. What do we have here? Priority transmission log. Station primer bands. Uh, over presently oversaturated with continual transmission from sister settlements. Fault signals are unable to be isolated for recording. Starlight broadcasts are coded gibberish. Could potentially use blackmail uh, to blackmail Singer has his signature all over it. Begin broadcasting. Personal files. Uh, clear blue skies. What is that? Where I say the future looking bright. Uh, I run a full amount of operations without ever... whatever. I don't think there's anything like all that particularly useful here. That's the exit. Okay, Hiram, right? Never thought I'd be ecstatic at having the walls painted in blood, but seeing as it's not mine, I'd say this calls for a celebration. My compliments on your improvised utilization of the fire suppressant system. I would expect nothing less from one of Neoka's associates. As usual, I'll take that as a compliment. Of course. This ought to square our debt. One hefty payment for a highly valued service rendered. But, I admit, I do wonder why Nioka has brought you to me. Allow me to pose my question in another manner. Why, in the nebula, are you here? A uh, few reasons. You know why I'm here. Can we continue our conversation from... The intercom now? Uh, if you insist. As I was telling you before, I am the premier broker for all of Monarch. Phineas must have sent you. He's the only one insane enough to I send didn't say him on that on the me. intercom, I knew though. It was only a matter of time before he came a knocking. Look, I might be late, but I fulfill my contracts always. Oh, you do, do you? I have lost track of the number of beers you owe me for chasing Raptodons off your stoop. You said that in a way that was almost believable. I take offense to that. Look, okay. Just, it might take me a while this time. Uh, why is that? I am awaiting but a single incoming transmission containing the information we desire. But MSI and the Iconoclasts are clogging the airwaves from Stellar Bay and Amber Heights. In their war against each other, they're scrambling each other's outgoing transmissions. Luckily, however, the Iconoclasts have now gone silent. You wouldn't know anything about that, would you? Hmm. Maybe. If you did, then you would have had my impressed gratitude. Still, we need to get MSI off the airwaves. I will leave the means to that particular end under your discretion. Okay, this is a problem. How? The bandwidth! There's too much blasted background noise! Nothing gets through but their local broadcasts. Which, of course, has inadvertently affected the incoming port and my livelihood. Okay. Can we cut them off from inside the station? No, they're jamming the limited frequencies we have at our disposal. Nothing extra planetary can get in or out until the frequency pollution thins out. The safest bet is to convince Sanjar and MSI to stop transmitting on their end. Okay, I think I can do that. I'll talk some sense into them. You do that, I'll be here waiting on the receiving end. Luck be with you. I have a feeling you'll be needing a pinch of it, plus a vat of patience. Uh, Nyoka needs a favor too. Oh, great. 
I love doing pro bono work for friends. Aw, you called us friends. I'd normally entertain your self-aggrandizing delusions, but this time it's important. Important to you is not the same as important to me. Although I do recognize that you may have earned some goodwill during your months laboring for me. She's your friend and she needs... Uh, she's in need. You're the only one who can help. Tug on my heartstrings, why don't you? Look, I'll do what I can, alright? Rebecca Hodges and Anders Wattsworth. They took a UDL contract back when Monarch went to ship, and I need to find them. I believe them to be on Terra too. If UDL hired two hunters back then, it would have been for creature clearing purposes round one of their spacer's choice outposts. These are the coordinates for the outpost under the last UDL contract. Now scram. And, uh, good luck. Okay. So your information broke, what's that? Is that a trick question? Because to answer it, you'd need to pay me. Of course, I could offer you a vastly more interesting bit of data instead. Try me. Ask me anything you'd like. I'll even offer it for free. We'll call it an exchange for your help with the broadcast. Ask me what you will. I need to find science weapons. Uh, have you received any broadcasts from Earth? What? No. Why would I go out of my way to intercept messages from Earth? There's no market for them. No buyer means it's not worth my time. Now, if you wanted me to intercept a certain one, that might be worth it for the right price. Okay. Uh, you know what? How Never mind. Nioka? Uh, where was the... Science Weapons Quest? Space Crime Continuum? Oh, I need... No, that's not that. Weapons from the Void, right? Black oh, Black Market Vendors, not, not... Yeah, okay. I think, yeah, this one were completed, now we need to bolt with his name. Error and unseen, well, that's what we need to complete, right? Yeah. Well, we need to return to Zora, and we need to return to Ash, so we'll do that now. Um, yeah. Don't buy the sun. Uh, we also probably should change the partner to uh, Parvati. Yeah, I think that's, that's the plan. Okay then, let's uh, let's get out of here. I think there was an exit here. Yep. First, we need to go to the Iconoclasts, right over to here. Talk to Zora, then talk to Ash. I don't mean to judge, but are you ever sober, Miss Remnerim? Hey. Right. Also, you trade ammo, heavy ammo, except you. Heavy ammo, so good. Zora, got some news for you. Welcome back. You find anything out there? Um, found a box of data cartridges. Let's see. These are old. Looks like correspondences between the pirates. Some bits here, some there, some. Wait. This... this one's got the Amber Heights gate code on it, just like the one I found earlier. And here's... a letter. Wait, this is from Graham. 
Oh, of all the... Captain. He gave them the gate codes. Told you. He caused the attack. Yeah. He did. He really did. I know he's got his head in the clouds, but... I always believed there was a core of good there. What the hell happened to live and let live? Thank you for bringing this back, but I need some time. I gotta think. I'll let you know if I figure something out. Okay, good luck with that. Um, but for now, I need to go talk to Ash. Uh, get out of here. Ash, buddy! I got the box for you. Now, please tell me who the hell are you? If you got in your mind that I want company, nothing on this moon for nobody. Okay, okay. I found found Lamont's box, buddy. You know, a tiny part, a damn stupid part of me hoped he was still out there. What happened? Hmm. They bought themselves a ticket of wood, but they were attacked while waiting for it. Damn. Well, you find our box of memories? Yeah, thing is I found a list of agents in that outpost. You aren't on it. <laughs> well, ain't you clever. Fine. I was supposed to pick him up that night. Thing is, another offer came along. Bit more lucrative. Hmm. Uh, let me guess, that's not a box of memories. Surely ain't. But it'll buy me some better ones. Look, I like your gumption. I was gonna share the bits, but here's a couple extra. Now go on. Leave an old man to his past. Okay. See you around. Cool, a level. Now, what did I want to do? Did I want to increase my persuade? I think so. Or did I want... Hmm. Maybe lie a little bit more? Hmm. Or long guns. 80. Deadly focus, no open sway for 5 seconds after each kill. I think I got my weapon sway under control now, so that won't be that necessary. Long gun critical hits at 100. Ignore armor. Dodge recovery speed. Dodge protection. I don't use dodge all that much. I probably should use it more often, really. Um, well, let's go with uh, with lie to sixty. Cause I don't know what scrambled auto mechanical means, but I think they attack faster when they're scrambled, so we will stop that. <laughs> but I think I will make a cut here. And we'll continue in the next episode. Thank you for watching, and bye!